With traffic around schools becoming a big problem, schools in Birmingham are taking part in a campaign to tackle the issue. It's a targeted campaign, so we're working with schools um, across Birmingham where accident rates are higher than in other areas, um, that's child pedestrian casualties, um, and we're trying to make drivers understand that the zigzag lines are there for a reason and that is to keep children safe as they come to school and leave school. Um, and so we're working with schools, um, police officers and obviously the children are involved. They've been making lovely posters and, and writing poetry um, which can be quite emotive. Making drivers under aware that the zigzag lines should not be parked on it is illegal and it is all for, about children's safety. The campaign also aims to reduce the number of cars on the road. Well, this is part of a, a, a wider package of measures that the City Council and its partners can offer to schools. Just to make the roads safer, we would also um, want more children walking to school, so that's also been a strong element of this campaign, encouraging people that live locally, who don't need to get in their cars, to get out of their cars and walk. It's, it's the best option and it also takes cars off the road, um, with making everybody safer. For Birchfield School, traffic is causing safety concerns. We had a problem with the parents parking and also members of the public parking around the school area, especially on our zigzag lines, and uh, they do a lot of U-turns into our school entrance. And because of that, we were concerned about the safety of our children uh, leaving and arriving at school, and it's a safeguarding issue for the school to make sure that the, school are, the children are safe at school. Pupils are embracing their campaign, taking part in a number of activities. Well, they've been outside this morning wearing their high-vis jackets, and they've been trying to encourage their parents that are dropping off the children to not drop the children directly by the school, but to park further away. Uh, and then there was an assembly where the police came in this morning, and a lady from the local authority came in to talk to us about road safety and how the children should cross the road, in which um, the children enjoyed that. And then they've also been doing poetry and writing poems about how to stay safe on their own. And uh, the posters behind me that you may be able to see, they're producing posters to try and remind them and their parents how to use the road safely around the school. With the children taking the lead, the school hopes drivers will begin to listen. Lindsay Smith, for The Midland, in Birmingham.